Hey guys, and welcome back to another more with Moro's video. Today's video, as you guys can see, is going to be a Trader Joe's haul. I've been trying to go there at least once a month. That way I can stock up on my favorite items, try new products, and also I wanted to try some of their new fall items as well. So I did get a handful of stuff, their fall items, that I'm excited to try and have the kids try as well. But, um... <laughs> Frank has already been opening up some of the stuff and trying it. <laughs> I was just gonna leave it over there and let you snack and then I was just gonna show it. <laughs> you can have it, it's fine, yeah, babe. <laughs> I was still like, I, we skipped out on lunch today and I was like, Brittany, I'm starving. I've gotta have something to eat. As soon as we get home, <laughs> I'm going straight for the chips. he pulls out the chips and this bruschetta sure. sauce, oh, which we got this last time. We tried it for the first time last time and we loved it. Let As you can see, Frank loves it too. Paired with that, oh my god. Really good. Those are, I think that's actually a new item. The Salsa Verde corn tortilla chips. I'm pretty sure this is new. Anyways, okay, we're gonna jump right into this haul. Let me show you guys everything that we got and of course show you some of their new fall items as well. Starting over here, I got the kids some cheddar cheese rocket crackers. I'm not sure if these are new. I've just never seen them before. So I thought the kids might really like these in their lunches. So I got that. And then as you guys can see, here's some of the new fall items. Well, I don't know if they're new or not, but they're new to me because I've never tried them. So I picked up a box of the pumpkin cereal bars. I'm like kicking myself for not getting two of these. I guess I kind of want to see if the kids will like them first, but I got a box of those. And then also a box of the maple leaf cookies. It has smooth maple flavored cream filling. I don't know, that just sounded so good to me. I did get a lot of stuff for, in mind for the kids' lunches, but some of the stuff I'm like, I got a taste test first for myself. And then I'm really, really excited about this. The guy that was checking this out for us said this is his favorite, favorite fall item. So I'm excited to try it and I'm excited to see if the kids will like it as well. And I did get some of my favorite mini milk chocolate peanut butter cups. This is definitely a must have item. If you go to Trader Joe's, get these. You guys, these are good. These are like perfect for like a late night snack, just like a handful of them. You could even put them on ice cream if you want to. I love those so much. So I got myself one of those and then I stocked up on some of their creamy tomato soup. I'm a sucker for soup, especially tomato. And I don't think I've tried theirs yet. I actually saw a recipe on Pinterest to take this combined with some baby spinach and then also their stuffed gnocchi. So I think we're gonna try that for a dinner meal this week and then make some grilled cheeses too for the kids. So I got two boxes of those, baby spinach. And then last time I went to Trader Joe's, I got this carne asada thinly sliced beef sirloin. I'm trying to pick it up. And Frank and I, Love these so much. We made some, I can't remember, did we even, we didn't even put seasoning on them. We just grilled them up, yeah. cut them up, put little cilantro and white onion with so tortillas, good. and it was the best. I love it. So every time we go, I'm probably gonna pick up a pack of this. And then I also got some seedless grape medley. The kids really like these, especially Harlow. She loves grapes last time, and I like that it comes with different ones. Plus, I really like these grapes right here. And then I showed you guys the bruschetta sauce, and then I got the kids some of these dark chocolate cookie sticks. I feel like this would be a good little treat to go into their lunches. And then I also saw these apple cider donuts. So I went ahead and got these, because the kids, they love, we have a, a farm kind of nearby us that we go every fall. They make the best apple cider donuts. Probably, I'm gonna say, probably not as good as Trader Joe's because they're fresh, but the kids love them. So I feel like this is like a good alternative for right now. So got some of those. I got some cilantro to go with the tacos. We did pick up a few bottles of red wine here lately. Frank and I have been really into drinking red wine and trying different ones. And Trader Joe's actually has a huge selection and they're pretty inexpensive as well. So I'm not gonna even attempt to try to say the name. I don't even know the name of this one. This one's called purebred and then I don't know how to pronounce that but we're gonna try those and see how we like them. If you guys hear anything in the back, we just got some McDonald's DoorDash. <laughs> if this is not a really realistic moment right now, you just spend an hour or so grocery shopping just to come home and DoorDash. <laughs> It's because you're tired from it. You don't want to cook by the time you get home. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys can relate to that. By the way, I love that you're still wearing your sticker that Scarlett got you from Trader Joe's. <laughs> There's a the thing about the kids. If they give me something, stickers. You're going to wear it proudly. I'm going to wear it proudly and I'm going to be like, 
That's just it. Make sure you take it off before you, you put it in the hamper. <laughs> oh, God. So if you guys hear anything in the back, that's probably gonna be the kids eating and Frank getting them ready for their food. I also picked up a box of their crunchy cinnamon squares. I don't think we've tried this yet, so I'm curious to see how it compares to cinnamon toast crunch. Is that what it is? We never buy that, so I'm like, what is it called? I'm excited to see if the kids will like that. Of course, I gotta stock up on Aria's favorite snack from Trader Joe's. Every single time I go, she always asks for their rolled corn tortilla chips, the chili and lime flavored. These are probably better than Takis, in my opinion, and Aria has said the same exact thing. Even Frank really likes them, and he didn't really like Takis before, but these, the something about the flavoring, the chili and lime flavoring is so much better than Takis. So I got her two bags of those, and then this is one of my favorite snacks, their coconut cashews. Really, really good. I love to just eat like a handful of those. One time I ate the whole bag, but I'm gonna try not to do that. <laughs> but these are really good. I got two boxes of the spinach tornellini. This is also going to be another meal for this week. I also got some of their vodka sauce to go with that. So that will be one meal. And then some little fruit jellies for the kids. Another little treat to put into their lunches. I was super excited. I couldn't resist myself. So Frank I got saw some, some bacon. bacon. It's uncured apple smoked bacon. The only thing is I've noticed there's not that much that comes in this pack. Or yeah, is there? It's a, it's they're like very, Oh, okay. They're thick slices, but They're... it's like perfectly portioned. Okay, I'm excited to try that. Every single time I go to Trader Joe's, I have to get some of my favorite salads. I'm trying their Mexicali salad for the first time. And then I really loved this one last time, the mozzarella and tomato salad. And then the Chinese inspired salad with chicken is also a personal favorite of mine. I picked up some yogurts for the kids. This one is blueberries and cream and vanilla and cream. And then this one is mango and cream and peaches and cream. I don't think I've gotten this one for the kids yet. So I'm excited to see if they'll like that or not. But last time I got the vanilla and blueberry cream one, they really, really like these yogurts. And then we got a gallon of milk. I also picked up a thing of their non-dairy oat beverage maple. I'm gonna make some of my own coffee at home, so I'm gonna actually use that to go in there for like a fall inspired coffee. And then I also got myself some almond milk. I love to put this in cereal whenever I have cereal or sometimes my oatmeal. This is the unsweetened original. And then I got two boxes of their organic frosted toaster pastry strawberry, like pretty much like a pop tart. Um, I think there was like a cherry pomegranate one. I didn't get that because I wasn't sure if the kids would like it or not. So I just got two of their strawberry, but here lately the kids have been really liking pop tarts in the morning and it's just an easy breakfast that we can just grab and they can eat in the car on the way to school on those super hectic, crazy busy mornings. So I, I was like, okay, we gotta stack up on those because they went through the Pop-Tarts like crazy last week and hopefully these are a little bit healthier than those. I uh, showed you guys the vodka sauce. Frank got some sriracha and roasted garlic barbecue sauce. That actually sounds really good and the cashier said it's like the perfect amount of spice and it's really good. And then he got some wings that we're probably gonna air fry. Two of those to go with the chicken. And then we also got two boxes of uncooked ground buffalo burgers. I'm excited to try those. We like to make burgers at least once every two weeks. So we're gonna try those and see how we like them. Got some cream cheese. This is Harlow's favorite because she has a bagel almost every single morning. I got some of their crunchy chili onion. It's like kind of like a, I would say a sauce, but you can, it says you can drizzle it over pasta, you can dip into bread, and you could use with your favorite protein. So if you wanted to put it on chicken, I've actually seen people put this on like avocado toast, which is why I got it. So I'm gonna try that to see if I like it with that. I got a white onion to go with the carne asada tacos and also these organic mini flour tortillas. These are really good. That's what we had with our tacos last time. And then Frank got some chocolate chip cookie doughs, chunky chocolate chip cookie dough. For a second, I thought it was double chocolate. So I thought it was like chocolate dough and then chocolate chips, but I think it's just like kind of like their regular, but I think it's just regular chocolate chip cookies. I don't know, I'm a sucker for some warm, freshly baked chocolate chip cookies though. And then I got two of these, pretty much like a mozzarella ball. I'm gonna make some pesto chicken this week. So we're gonna, I think I'm gonna try to do it a little bit different. We're gonna put, so instead of doing the shredded cheese on top, I'm gonna slice this mozzarella up and do slices on top of the chicken. So I got two of those and then I love the egg bites from Starbucks. I've been really bad lately and getting them almost every single morning. It's, it adds up and 
it's bad. <laughs> I really, really like them though. And for the most part, they're really healthy. So I saw that Trader Joe's has their own egg bites. This one is cheese, spinach, and kale. I think they had like a cheddar and bacon one as well. But I got two of these because I wasn't sure if I'm gonna like them or not. And it says it heats in 60 seconds. So we're gonna find out. I'm gonna try them this week. I usually like to put a little sauce, hot sauce on them and see if I like them. Got some bananas. I picked up two bags of these party size mini meatballs. I'm actually going to make some meatballs for Fletcher's birthday. So I got those for that. Some grape tomatoes to go with the pesto chicken. And then I showed you guys the stuffed gnocchi. Another one of our favorite meals is the barbecue chicken or teriyaki chicken. We got two bags of those and then they were out of the vegetable fried rice. So we got two of the chicken fried rice instead. But this is one of my favorite meals from Trader Joe's, like one of my favorite frozen meals. So I showed you guys the chicken. I also got two bags of their fancy berry medley. It has freshly picked blueberries, blackberries, and raspberries. I like to eat this with my yogurt, and then Arya also likes to make smoothies, and she'll put some of those in there as well. I got two boxes of the apple squeezies, or like the pouches, the apple and carrot. Fletcher really likes these, and I got him the carrot one to give him a little bit, try to get a little bit more veggies in him. So, like I said, two boxes of that, a bag of their yogurt pretzels, and then a bag of their cheese puffs. So I think that is everything. I've showed you guys everything that we got. Hopefully I'm not missing anything. But yeah, I'm really, really excited to try a lot of the the new fall stuff that they have and I'll let you guys know how I like them. But yeah, I think that is going to be it for this video. Let me know down below your favorite must-haves if you guys have tried anything new lately. Every time I go, I try to look at your guys' comments and see things that you recommend so the next time that I go, I can try it and then let everybody else know as well. So leave that down in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in our next video. Bye guys.